our girl Meg the Stallion has finally broke her silence on the entire situation between her and rapper Tory Lanez. So, since y'all hoes so worry about it, yes, this nigga Tory shot me. You shot me. And you got your publicists and your people going to these blogs lying and shit. Stop lying. Why lie? I don't understand. I tried to keep the situation off the internet, but you dragging it. You really fucking dragging it. Motherfuckers talking about I hit this nigga. I never hit you. Motherfuckers was like, oh, she mad because he was trying to fuck with Kylie. No, I wasn't. Like, you dry shot me. Like, everybody in the car. It's only four motherfuckers in the car. Me, you, my homegirl, and your security. Everybody in the car arguing. I'm in the front seat. This nigga in the back seat. I get out the car. I'm done arguing. I don't want to argue no more. I get out. I'm walking away. This nigga from out the back seat of the car starts shooting me. You shot me. I ain't get cut by no glass, but let me tell you why they saying that. When the when the police, because the people in the neighborhood, there's a witness. When the police came, because the, the neighbors called the police, this did not happen at Kylie house. This happened damn near back at the house I was staying at. I was just trying to get home. We was five minutes away from my spot. The police come. I'm scared. All this shit going on with the police. The police is, is shooting motherfuckers for anything. The police was literally killing black people for no motherfucking reason. Soon as the police tell us all get out the motherfucking car, the police is really aggressive. You think I'm about to tell the police that we niggas, us black people, got a gun in the car? You want me to tell the laws that, that we got a gun in the car so they can shoot all of us up? Nigga, I'm scared. It's a fucking helicopter over us and some more shit. Why the fuck would I tell the laws somebody got a gun in this car and this nigga shot me? So I can get shot, you can get shot, she can get shot, he can get shot. I ain't tell the police what happened immediately right then because I didn't want to die. I don't want to, I don't want the police to shoot me because it's a nigga with a gun in the car. I'm leaking, I'm bleeding. Motherfucker, somebody, I'm lying, bitch. Did I pay a helicopter to come over me and, and uh, record my feet leaking blood? No. How the fuck I'm going to fake that? I didn't tell the police nothing because I didn't want us to get in no more trouble than what we was already about to get in. The fuck? I get to the motherfucking hospital, the police bitch being so rude to me. Well, what, you know, what's going on? Like, da 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 da. You're being detained, da da da. Ma'am, I'm being detained, I'm leaking. But I'm still not saying what happened. Shit crazy. The motherfucking doctor, the police finally let me go. I ain't go to jail. Them three motherfuckers went to jail. I get to the I get to the hospital. The 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 doctors do x rays on my feet. Oh, ma'am, you got uh, bullets in your feet, got bullet fragments in your other foot. I'm damn, I'm thinking the doctors is the police, so I'm still trying not to tell them, like, no, nah, I, I didn't know I got sh You know what I'm saying? I'm scared. Like, I've never been shot before. And I don't have to lie about that. Why would I lie? You want me to be a bad person so bad, and y'all motherfuckers want to believe the lie before you believe the truth. Stop trying to come on the internet acting like a black woman, a, a grown-ass black woman, really got any reason to be lying on another grown-ass black man when all the shit fucked up going on in the world right now. If you really want to tell the motherfucking truth, I've tried to save this nigga. Even though he shot me, i tried to spare him. And y'all motherfuckers is not sparing me. That's crazy. That's fucked up. I go through so much shit on a daily basis anyway than to have to get on the motherfucking internet where I'm just trying to make my music, do my shit, pop my shit like, like the bitch I always been. And I, I'm trying to save niggas. And y'all on the internet talking about, oh, bitch, you ain't get shot. Oh, bitch, you this. Oh, free tour. That nigga not in jail. He not in jail because I didn't tell the laws what happened as soon as it happened. And I should have. I'm smart. I didn't have to spare that nigga. I don't have to spare nobody, but I did. And I'm done. Y'all asking where, where people at? Why ain't nobody saying nothing? Ask them why they not saying nothing. I haven't talked to the same people. Y'all worry about where they at. I don't do, I don't lie. I don't lie. I don't have to lie. Ask that nigga why he not saying nothing. What the fuck he gonna get on here and say? 
Y'all shot her. Why? Tell her why you shot me. No reason. Stop fucking lying on me. Stop fucking acting like black women is the motherfucking problem. Stop acting like black women is aggressive when all they be doing is speaking the motherfucking facts and you motherfuckers can't handle it. Stop, stop spreading lies. Stop getting on the internet acting like this shit your motherfucking diary. Stop lying on people. Truth motherfucking is, bitch, you shot me. Yes. You scared to come tell everybody that you fucking shot me and you got your whole fucking team on the internet lying trying to cover your motherfucking ass. And I'm tired of it. Stop doing that shit. Stop dragging me and y'all motherfuckers don't even know what was what really motherfucking happened. Y'all niggas wasn't there. Y'all motherfuckers be so quick. Oh, but uh, bitch, you a dry snitch. Oh, da da da. Who? You niggas talk more than bitches do. You niggas gonna tell on other people quicker than a bitch will. So don't ever play in my face like 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 I'm wrong. Y'all niggas don't know no code. Y'all niggas don't know no loyalty. I don't even know where half you motherfuckers be from on the internet. <laughs> Stop playing with me and don't play in my face no more. Mm, period. Okay. Period. And that was that. And there you have it. Our girl Meg the Stallion has finally broke her silence on the entire ordeal between her and rapper Tory Lane. So I really have nothing else to say. It's still a sad situation. Maybe now Tory will be arrested and maybe uh, Megan will probably be a little bit more careful about who she surrounds herself with. This story obviously is still developing because there is still only one side of the story that we're getting. I'm just going to say I believe the side that Megan just gave us, but the reality of it is is that we have to kind of give Tori a chance to speak. I could care less what he has to say because she literally just told us the truth. I, I wholeheartedly believe Megan. It, again, it's a sad situation, and I think this is a learning lesson for her, a lesson learned for her, and she will have no choice but to choose better people and get the right people around her and have them around her at all times. Again, Meg Thee Stallion just breaking her silence moments ago on the entire ordeal with Tory Lanez. She said it out loud, out loud, out loud. It's kind of late. I'm sorry. It's really past my bedtime. Out loud, live, and in color. You have it right there from the horse's mouth. Meg Thee Stallion.